Yeah. Very nicely done again. This is his chance to get it won. One. It was a really good queuing shot, this, wasn't it? Because, uh, you know, one or two of these shots might have gone astray today, but not that one. And as you say, a chance to finalise this match here. Black's a little awkward, but he can do plenty of damage on the, with the reds in the middle of the table with lower value colours, but he will need all of the reds now because it looks as if he's going to not score quite enough points to get the frame one before. The, the, the last red is potted, which is something in six red snooker, as we've been saying. Five reds, high value colours, is virtually frame over. Okay. It can be done very quickly, but it won't be done here like that. Lorenz. He just seems to have a very good attitude to the event. He's wanted to come here, he's come here, he's tried really hard, as we saw in that frame where he battled for the snooker. And at times he's played really, really well. One thing I will say is that when he does get to that left, that bottom red after he pots this one, he won't need a colour with it, so he won't be striving to get the cue ball out of that area. You only need the red, so whether James Watana comes back to the table, another matter. Oh, this mightn't have the pace to get where he wanted it, so he will come back to the table when the frame is not won. Yeah, so often these frames seem to come down to the last red. Looks good, doesn't it? Looks very good. Well, it's not too inviting, this, is it? You're 31 points down with 35 on. Snookered on the red. It's very easy to hit the black coming from that left side. Indeed, even from the right side. Well, he didn't hit anything. Wow. And a miss? A miss is called 35 in it. Um, whether that rule is right or not, I don't know, but that is the rule. I mean, I always think that you've kind of lost the advantage when you only tie the frame. Well, then, O'Sullivan hasn't taken the miss. Strange. I mean, you would take it, wouldn't you, if it was offered you? I think, yeah, I think he, he sometimes he, he doesn't agree with it, maybe. I don't know, but he didn't take it. Yeah, well, fair enough, but that's a very noble thing to do, but it doesn't mean your opponent would do the same <laughs> in, in those circumstances, I guess. Surely not. Surely not. Wow, what a way to win the match. Wow. And <laughs> look at that. Look at those scenes between these two legends of our sport. James Watt and I love being out there again. And he'll be back out tomorrow in the last 16. But uh, you won't see a match finish in more gracious fashion than that, will you? James Watt and I, a Thai legend. Ronnie O'Sullivan, an all-time legend sharing an embrace after that gigantic fluke from O'Sullivan to ultimately win this match. Here it is again. It actually rolled away from the cushion, this. Yeah. I was amazed it dropped in. Maybe it had a bit of spin on the ball and it just spun back in. But that was... He looked over a little sheepishly and I think James Watson had enough. He was happy to end the match there and we saw what happened after that. <laughs>